This is the smartest way to make $10,000 per month. Please note, it is not the fastest, but it's the smartest. If you're watching this video, you're probably expecting me to give you some kind of a magic pill that will get you rid of all of your problems and you will start printing money. There you go again with the same repeating cycle of thought. If you really want to follow the correct steps for new year, new me, and you really want to be serious about it, then you need to watch this video. My name is Sherban Sida, and I started making $10,000 per month with this business model a long time ago. And not only that, but I've been able to consistently make at least 10 k per month just to prove it that it takes no luck and anyone can do it if they put in the effort. If you didn't notice by now, the business that I'm talking about is called dropshipping. And even though I've been doing this since 2016, I've only recently cracked the code. Now I understand what I need to do in order to have a successful drop shipping store and I can replicate that as many times as I want. So in this video, I'm going to tell you what are the exact steps that I'm taking in order to be profitable with my dropshipping stores. For those of you that don't know yet, let's start with the basics. What is dropshipping? Dropshipping is a very simple business model in which you're selling products that you do not own. Those products are in a warehouse in China. All you have to do is build a store and sell any product that you want at a higher price than what you're getting it. Let's take this toy as an example. This supplier from China sells it for like $6 and we are pricing it at $20 on our website. The best part about dropshipping is that when somebody buys the product from us, they give us the money first. So we can use that money to pay for our supplier, which is $6. And then we can just pocket the difference. Easier said than done. You will be surprised that 90% of dropshippers fail. That is because they are not using the same system as I am using. This system consists in five major pillars that can make any dropshipping store profitable. So let's talk about the first pillar, which is finding the best product to sell. Now listen, I know that the dropshipping business model sounds very tempting, and it is. But the truth is that that there are hundreds of products that are being pushed on the Western markets every single day from the Chinese suppliers. Now, the thing is that 90%, more than 90% of those products are garbage. And we all know that nobody buys garbage. So now the question is, how can we know what products should we sell on our dropshipping store? The answer is very simple. We're gonna have to do product research in a way or another, and we can do it manually or automatically. So if you wanna do it manually, you're gonna have to take those products and test them on your store. Or you can go to Google Trends and write something like, Chris Christmas, for example, and you're gonna see what are the peak interests for this term. This way, you're gonna be able to know when to sell Christmas related products. The problem with these methods is that both of them are stealing the best resources that we got, and that is time and money. So, for me, the best way to not waste that time and money is to use an automation tool such as AutoDS. Because they have already invested time and money to find the best winning products out there, and these are products that are making waves on the market. For example, let's check out their winning products hub. This is a hub, as the name suggests where they are posting winning products every single day. Each and every product that you can find here can be clicked and once you click it, it will take you to a product page and this product page will give you a lot of useful information about that product, such as how much is the product being sold for, what is the potential profit, you're gonna have an engagement score, saturation score, which will tell you how saturated is the market for this product. You can have targeted audiences. If you scroll a bit down, you're gonna find some social ads that you can click and you can get inspired to see what works and what doesn't work. If you scroll a bit more down, you're gonna find some other websites that are selling this product. And if you click on each and every of these websites, it will take you to basically another store that's selling this item. This is a very useful tool because it acts like a spying tool so you can spy on other stores and see how they are selling this product. And any product that you can find on AutoDS, it's already vetted, it's already making waves on the market. Once you decide on a product that you wanna sell, you just click on import draft. This will import the product to your AutoDS draft section and it will allow you to change everything that you want about that product. Pictures, description, title, everything. Oh, by the way, I definitely recommend you to check out their AI tool. This will use AI to change your title and description. You can set it just the way you want to. It depends a lot on the product that you're selling, but you can make it funny, you can make it professional, you can make it warm, you can make it cold. And once you're happy with all of the changes that you made, all you have to do is click on save and import. This will basically import all of the changes that you have made into your Shopify store. And they are not called an automation software for no reason because you can automate your whole business with them. For example, they are also doing fulfillment. So once you get any order on your store, they will take care of it. So you don't have to take care of shipping, you don't have to take care of anything. 
they will take care of it and they will mark every order as shipped. Also, if you want to sell a product that's not on AutoDS, they are working with a lot of suppliers. You have the list here on the screen so that any product that you can find on these suppliers' websites, you can import it very easy to your AutoDS account and from there, push it to your store and start selling it. And speaking about your store, this takes us to the second pillar of success, which is building your store. Now, creating a nice store is very, very important because this is the place where everybody will come to buy your products and for this i've chosen to work with shopify because they are so easy to work with everything is so easy to understand it's basically kindergarten level and you can create your store in a matter of hours with basically drag and drop features but i don't want to get lost in details and i want to let you know that if you're a beginner you do not know how to build a proper Shopify store. There will have to be a lot of trial and error in order for you to build a good store. So let's not waste valuable resources into building our store. And let me show you my screen. Let me show you the solution that I found. When it comes to creating your very own Shopify store, AutoDS comes into play helping us save a lot of time and money because they have this amazing feature that will build us a fully functional Shopify store with the help of AI in less than two minutes. This is how you can get your store. On the AutoDS homepage, click on the name of your store and click on Add Store. After that, select Shopify Store, click Continue. There's the option to connect an already existing store. There's the option to create a new store through Shopify. And there's a third option, the middle one, which will help you generate a store with AI. Let's select that. Let's click Continue. After that, you need to select the niche that you want your store to be in. If you don't know, then just click I'm not sure. Then click Next. And it says right here, AI is building the store for you. Once you see this page, you're all set. Congratulations, your store has been successfully created. And this is all the information that you're gonna need to claim it. So go to the login page of Shopify, copy this email that you got from the AutoDS store builder, paste it here, click continue with email, and the password will be the one below it. Copy it, go here, paste it, and click login. And there you go, this is your brand new store. Keep in mind you only have a free trial of around 2 or 3 days, so make sure to activate your basic plan which only costs $1. Select confirm billing cycle, then proceed with adding a payment method, you can add a credit card or PayPal. And finally you will have the option to subscribe, once you click this you will subscribe to Shopify. The website looks something like this, we have a custom made logo as well, looks pretty cool, pretty clean. We also have a lot of winning products added here, courtesy of AutoDS. And if you go back to your Shopify store and click products from the left-hand side, you're going to be able to see all of the products that have been imported with AutoDS. Keep in mind, all of these products are trending right now. If you want to be able to keep up with the latest trends and always have access to the best winning products out there, make sure to create an account with AutoDS and import the newest products to your store. Now, just like I showed you how to build a website, we now have a website and we have decided on the product that we want to sell. Now, the next thing for us to do is pillar number three, which is creating an attractive product page. Now, this will make or break your business. You need to have a very high converting product page because that is the place where 99% of your visitors will go to. The product page is basically a page on your store that will showcase the product that you're selling. Let me give you an example of a high converting product page that bought me $10,000 in sales in January 2024 alone in one of my stores. Now, this is the product page. It's a very simple product. It actually cleans your toilet, a thing that nobody wants to do. So the product page that I built here touches some very, very important points. First of all, the title. It says 70% off today only. This is very important. Second of all, if you look right under it, five-star review, right below it, there's a huge discount from $70 to $23. This is not actually a real discount, but people want to see discounted prices. More than that, I'm offering two different sizes so people can pick between them. If you scroll a bit down, as you can see right here, I'm offering bundles so they can buy one, they can buy two, or they can buy a pack of three products and they will get the biggest discount. This will allow me to increase my AOV, which stands for average order value. So let's scroll a bit down and as you can see right here, I have a very good product description. I touched every single point that people want to see. And if you scroll a bit more down, you're going to see that I have used a lot of gifts. This is an example of a product that's selling very well because I have used gifts on the product page. That is very important because if I would have only used pictures, it would not work the same because people want to see the product being in use. More gifts, more powerful words, some pictures in here. 99.9% .9 effective bacteria removal. And also the final thing that I'm touching here is the review section. 
First of all, you want it to be perfect. You only want to have five star verified reviews. And second of all, you don't want to have any mistakes or typos here in the review section. So these are some very important points that you really want to touch with your product page. The title, the price, bundles, a very good description, gifts of the product being in use, and finally, a very good review section at the bottom of the page. This website with this specific product and this specific product page brought in more than $10,000 in sales in January 2024. Guys, pillar number four is getting traffic. Now, there are two main ways to get traffic to your store. One of them is free and the other one is paid. With the free one, you will trade your time for traffic and with the paid one, you will trade money. Although I think that both of them are good for your business, I kind of prefer the second one, the paid one, because it gets the customers closer to you at a rapid pace. So one example that you can use to get free traffic to your store is to just buy the product for yourself, wait for it to be shipped to your address and use your phone to do some videos of the product being in use. Post those videos on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube Shorts, and in those videos, prompt people to visit your website. Now, the key to this method is to do it consistently, meaning that you have to do this two or three times every single day and you need to find different angles into promoting your product every single time. So just making a video of your product being in use once will not work. You will need to find a lot of creative ways in which you can advertise that product for free. And with the paid way, you are basically paying a platform to give you some eyeballs. For example, we are paying TikTok $50 to show our ads to 2,000 people. There is this thing called conversion rate. The conversion rate tells us how many people have bought the product from the total people that have visited our store. As you can see, the conversion rate on this store was close to 4%, meaning that for every 100 people that visited my store, four of them bought the product. Now you have to do your math and you have to make sure that the money that you're paying for TikTok is worth it for the traffic that they are giving you. This is why you're going to have to do a testing phase in order to find out if you are profitable with your ads or not. Within the testing phase, you will be able to make a decision about your ads. You will be able to know if the ads are worth it or not. And guys, we have reached the final pillar of success and that is customer experience. You see, the customer's experience doesn't end when they buy a product from you because after they receive receive the product, you can use them as testimonials. You can also use them to sell them another product. And also your product might be damaged. It might be broken. So you definitely need to take care of that. You don't want any negative reviews. Handling negative customer experience will help you build a better brand, something that a lot of people are neglecting. And it's one of the driving forces that keep them from building a real brand. So guys, that was it. Success is simple. Do not overcomplicate it. Finding the best product to sell building a website, create a very good high converting product page, get traffic and take care of your customers. These five pillars help me get to $10,000 per month consistently. I strongly believe that if you apply all of these pillars to your dropshipping store, you will also get to $10,000 per month. If you have any questions, drop a comment below and I will personally help you. Thank you for watching. Until next time.